What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, John, for the Gamer Day here. Welcome and you back to some more Sogalock. Um, also, welcome back to more John Records Late Night because it's the only time John feels like he could record. Um, well, how are you all doing today? Hopefully, you're all having a wonderful, splendid, fantastic, mesmerizing day. It is Sunday, the 2nd of January. I was going to say July, but, you know, we're not that far into 2022. So, um, my question to you is, what is your New Year's resolution? So, mine is <clears throat> to get better at editing. And you'll hopefully see that in Saga Lock and other series as well. Um, but we'll see. Will you be able to see that? Who knows? But we have a team to go over. We have our boy, Dakon. It's supposed to be a boy. Gosh dang it. Anyway, for some reason, when Dakon transferred over, he became a she. And I don't know what... I'm, I tried to fix it. It just didn't work last time. We got a low kick, bulk up, um, poison pink, and toxic. Not like there's anything wrong with that, but it just doesn't work the way it's supposed to. Then we got Brittany holding the Oran Berry with Swift, Aqua Jet, Fly, and Surf. We then got Patrat at level 15 with Tackle, Moonlight, or not Tackle, Tickle, Moonlight, Headbutt, and Wake Up Slap. And then we got Kaiba Boy with our Kabutops holding the Oran Berry with the moves rock polish stone edge which i want to move up here uh water gun and smackdown so honestly i like our moveset i like the way the things are shaping up also i didn't realize i could do that what i'm wow okay you know so games sometimes actually do good things and i yeah wow okay <laughs> good job me not knowing that there actually was a good in that okay good Cool. We got Brittany and a couple of months set up the way I want to have them set up. Cool. That's 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 beautiful. Um, now I gotta check my potion box because I probably don't have any potions. Knowing me, oh no, there it is. We have five. I do not trust that. We're gonna go buy more potions. Um, yeah, John and trusting things. No, no, not what? When would I ever trust something? That really should be a New Year's resolution. To, to, if I'm gonna keep it, keep it a buck with y'all, that should be. A New, Year's, New Year's resolution is being able to trust people more, but well, we all know that's impossible for the John to be able to do. Um, kind of a sad thing when I think about it, but it also is innately true. I have very, very little trust in people, and like it's hard for me to trust. Like, if I trust you, then you're a great person. Um, and like, if I, I mean, I, but I mean by that is if I fully trust you, like if I 100, if I'm 100% like, yep, nope, you're a good person. Like, I know you're a good person and I can put my full word on that, then, you know, that's great. <laughs> but like, it's something I don't really say very often is like, you're amazing. I love you. You're the best. Joy literally is the only person that gets that like genuinely, um, at the, like, uh, in the community and then the people that I talk to uh, online. Um, it's kind of interesting when you think about it because it is, it is, it is a me problem. It's not a you problem. Um, it's more of a, like, conceptually, I try and I'm like trying to figure out like, how can I 100% trust you to the fullest extent, fullest possibility. And it's just like, it's hard because it's like, again, it's the you want to. I want to believe everything is genuine and real, but then if I don't feel 100% attached to that, it's just like, eh. But that's why Joy's the only one that gets brought up in the whole, Joy is amazing, and we love Joy and all that stuff. Like, I know a lot of people probably are going to get sick and tired of me saying that constantly, but again, it is it is a truthful statement. That's why I don't say it about anybody else, and I haven't said it about anybody else in, in year lock or in month fucking whatever this is. Uh... Anyways, wow. I know, great start. Um, but it's fine, guys. I'm totally 100% okay with everything that's gone on in the past 24 hours. Um, and it definitely isn't New Year's Eve or anything. But yeah, so moving on before I want to literally scream and restart the video. Um, yeah, so <laughs> we're in the first gym, guys. Yay. <laughs> God. Frack. Um, we're actually getting close to where we lost. This is actually the episode which we lost last time. We beat Salan, we did all the stuff, and we're like, yes, we're making it far, we're doing the thing, and then we lost, and it was big it was a big sad moment. So um we definitely want to prevent the big sad moment of dying to Jonas. 
Um, because of course it would be the Jonas. Um, and then, uh, just moving on and kind of getting to new spots and I'm excited. So if you guys haven't watched, I want to say it's cage bowl. Um, it was a series between Nick and joy and it, it is this kind of, Oh, you have sturdy. This kind of situ this reminds me of Cage Bowl a little bit because I'm like, okay, we're fighting. We got a team. I feel like I've got the Joy's team. Like, Joy's team was really good for Cage Bowl, and Nick kind of got the short end of the stick. And I have really in in my Cage Lock experience, I've never. F it's I feel bad for Aaron, right? Because I've never felt like I've had the short end of a stick in a Cage Lock. But also, I don't know if I can attribute that to my Pokemon being, like, so much better. Because when I look at my teams and compare it to the Aaron's team, our teams were decently even, right? Like, it's just the way I utilized my mods were completely different. And I that leads me into this other point that I actually wanted to talk about. I want to talk about that a little bit more, right? I want to talk about why Kabutops is a mod that I don't prefer to use in a Nuzlocke. Or why Beautiful Eye is like why dust talks can be so good um and like bring up some of these situational things that don't get talked about it, it's 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 a niche area right like in a lot of youtube and a lot of figuring out with youtube is figuring out what niche fits you and that is something that i've been looking at these last few like <sighs> decades these last few months is what niche fits me and what does things and we've pseudo landed on this topic a couple times now um jonas and joy and i and we've all kind of landed on the topic of talking about competitive pokemon um but also i was like that i was hellbent on oh competitive oh why does it have to be competitive it doesn't and i i finally had this epiphany today that i was like you know, I don't have to talk about competitive Pokemon necessarily, but I can talk about why this Pokemon can be a threat. Why, what makes this Pokemon a potential issue? Um, and I'm excited for that. It's, I'm actually scripting the first episode of that um, as I talk about it. it. It is a process. It is something that has to be scripted, and we have to figure out things and talk about a po and like the editing and all that stuff. It's going to be... I want to fashion design it and like stitch it up you know crochet it and make it like into this ugly beautiful mess that's a good way to describe it because that's kind of what happens on a first video is it it is it is an ugly beautiful mess and you can't really it is what it is it is gonna be this oh it's clarence it is gonna be this ugly beautiful mess of what is it gonna be and how is it gonna turn out and what's gonna make it what it is and yeah like i said i'm excited because I think the Pokemon that I chose to do first is kind of a perfect Pokemon to talk about when it comes to Nuzlocke killers and what what makes X Pokemon Nuzlocke killer. What, well, X, Y, Z. And I want to talk about the different characteristics of these Pokemon too and why and like, oh, like, and why, why you don't want this Mon to be on your Nuzlocke team. Why you want this Mon to be on your Nuzlocke team. Um, what makes a good Nuzlocke team? the synergies and everything else is and we can talk to kind of figure it out on the fly right like that is kind of and how to figure it out on the fly because not a lot of people know that hey we got to figure this you got to figure this out. oh 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 i think this is our opportunity to say goodbye to bulk up Yeah. Bye, bulk up. Have a great day. I prefer toxic. Um, interesting. Okay, but yeah, why did I do get rid of bulk up? Well, because I don't utilize bulk up. I haven't clicked bulk up. Why bulk up is actually not as good of a move as you think it is. Like, that, that that's a great title. Like, that's something I wish I could utilize and put into content. And it, it is, like, a passion. Like, a thing that I can see myself doing and it actually going well and going over. Oh, thank you. What does Sandstream do? Like, what is what 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 makes this situation even better i have more special defense um but yeah like i can talk about all of this stuff and kind of nail it down to a science and kind of break it down and make it what it is like 
I, again, I know it's more talking about things that are future endeavors, and I know this is not what's going on in the game right now, especially after we just bombasted this first gym leader. Um, and now Kaiba wants to learn a move that I, no, that's a no-no move. That is a no-no move. We don't we don't teach the no-no move. Um, yeah, no. Um, but yeah, like I'm, I, it is something that I'm very excited about and like wanting to get into and figure out. And I, this is like my time to figure it out while I'm not, you know, while I have, yes, I've got school. School is a thing that's going to be a thing, but like, it's actually pretty light duty when it comes to school. Um, so like, this is where, this is where it's time for me to, <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, joy. It's toxic! Who's slipping under? Just definitely not me. Um, <laughs> that, I don't know. That kind of implies that you're slipping under. That, that's, that's not what I'm at. Anyways, <laughs> we were talking about toxic, actually, the move. Um, a fun fact. Um, we, we were both like, why did you guys... Why did you let me have a Pokemon that have toxic, especially after I died to Wonder Guard? Well, it didn't matter. <laughs> I was going to have access to it in the first place. <laughs> oh, God. I love when the game is just perfect like that. It's just like, yep, nope, I'm going to give you this and uh, invalidate your entire what the f what the felony chat. Um, yeah, that's great. <laughs> uh, it can't get any better than that, though. Like, <laughs> again... Uh, that's amazing. That is wonderful. Um, we gotta teach cut to somebody, and I don't really know who. Um, let's see if any of our, our new recruits could have learned Toxic, because that would make it even better. Ah, oh, no. No, only Dakon can. <laughs> Never mind. Point's still valid. Um, okay, who's learning cut? Oh! For once, everybody can, huh? Okay. I mean, we all know who I'm teaching it to. Like, I think it's pretty blatant and obvious who's getting the, the shafted here. Um, by Moonlight. I'd rather use potions. Plus, but Trat's not going to be used, like, very often. So, like, who the, what's the point? Um, I feel like Patrat is go <laughs> going to have some sort of story. But I don't know it yet. And I am curious where that story is going to lead. How many Pokemon do I have? I think I've got like 15, but I want to make sure. 17. Oh, and a Premier Ball. See, so the... Um, actually, I learned something new today from Joy. Um, in a series that I don't know is out yet, so I'm not going to say the name of it. But... Apparently in Pokemon Black and White 2, they got rid of the Premier Ball situation. Like, you can't get a Premier Ball... Um, which is wild to me. Hey, hey, codename. Are you looking for some mysterious Pokemon too? Because I am. It's another Pokemon that you've talked about being a fun Pokemon to utilize. Uh, yeah, you're right. I, I thank you. Let's go on our adventure. Okay. Moon, 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 moon. Oh, wait. What's, what's this doing? I can't talk as Joy. I can't, I can, like, text as Joy, but I can't, like, I can text kind of as Joy, but not talk as Joy. It's kind of funny. Um, come on, make some dream mist. Ugh, you're not good enough, Muna. You are been told that you're the worst Pokemon ever. Huh? Who even are you? What are y'all doing? Are you talking to us? Ugh, we're Team Plasma. We liberate Pokemon for you foolish humans. What are we doing? Oh my god. This Pokemon, you know, it's Musharna. They exit vapor called Dream Mist. Ugh. Shows what you know about Pokemon. Ugh. We'll show them... The Muna will show them dreams and manipulate their hearts. Ugh. You stupid Muna. <laughs> Spit out Dream Mist already, you worthless chump. Ugh. You're kicking this Pokemon just so to give up Dream Mist? You're mean. Why? You're trainers too, though. Yeah, we're trainers. We're better than you because we free the Pokemon. We just, like, expand them for resources and, you know, want to murder them. And we take them away from stupid people like you. 
Oh, don't hurt Codename's feelings. I feel like that would be something that we would be, Joy and I would both be like, oh, you hurt somebody's feelings. We're mad. Like, you hurt my feelings. So now I'm gonna <laughs> be spiteful. Oh, you have a Drudagon. Hi. I was not ready for you at all. Okay, actually, I wanted to check that that deck on stats. I, I'm stuttering because this is a dread I got on our screen. Um, okay, yeah, Sludge Wave was fine. Okay. Ah. Uh, Sludge Wave is technically better, too, than, uh... Hmm. I trust in Dacon, okay? I have the trust, full faith in Dacon to get this done. Oh, I thought that was going to be way more. I was worried about Dakon dying, and Dakon's like, what are you worried about, my dude? Like, chill. Uh, you don't have to be freaked out over everything. You should have learned that lesson already. I, I get it, Dakon. I, I get it. I get it. But I'm still going to be overly worried about you because I love you, and that's why they can't liberate my Pokemon, because I love you too much to liberate. Um, honestly... Good lines. Let's go. I love you too much for them to liberate you from me. Freaking let's go. Ah, Tapeg. That's, that's an easy kill. <laughs> Watch this easy kill be the thing that, like, oh, no, we're going to go to Brittany. What am I think? Watch this Pokemon be the way to kill Dakon. No, we're going into our quad, our actually, um, oh, wait, no, it is quad resisted. Our quad resisted to fire Pokemon because Brittany has heat proof. So, fire attacks are actually quad resisted instead of dually resisted. So, we definitely have a fire answer at all times. Whenever fire gets out, we just send in Brittany and we murder. Um, but what it is fun is that the the two that you left me have utility with each other. And they are fun to play with and be, like, mess around with. Because it's like, that, that's why I was scared of Dakon dying. Because, well, I'm sorry, I care about Dakon. And, um, <laughs> but yeah, I was like actually worried because I was like, oh no, I've cared about this Pokemon and stop kicking the thing. Oh my gosh. I want to like slay this dude right now. Okay. Like that, that, that grunt deserves to be slain. What are you two doing? Goofing off. Oh my God. We team plasma shall separate Pokemon from foolish people. And if you're going to be foolish, then uh, you can't fulfill your duties. Th this isn't. Gatsis is... Why is he gathering followers? And Gatsis, what is he trying to control people by tricking them with his speeches? Yeah, like, Gatsis... Uh, this is Gatsis when a plan has failed. He's gonna issue punishment. At any rate, let's hurry. We gotta run. Bye! You get yourself, Musharna. Oh, that was actually the... That was the Musharna. I put the Muna. Let's go, Musharna. Protect them youngins. Them youngins deserve to be protected. Let's go, uh... Wow, Musharna just caused a dream like that? And, whoa. I know, like, isn't that awesome, Joy? Like, this Pokemon can actually, like, cause you to have your dreams that you want to have. No, actually doesn't cause the dreams you want to have. It just causes, like, that was just for protection. But, like, what if? Oh, my God. I'm going here. I'm going here. I don't care. I'm going here. What if Muna could sense what you were thinking and give you the dreams that you wanted? That would be such an interesting Pokemon. Like, <laughs> I can hear my mom laughing in the background. <laughs> uh, so, anyways, continuing forth with this com conversation topic, what if, because, <laughs> you know, uh, like, what if, like, you just knew, like, this Musharna, you had the Pokemon. Also, I kind of want that because I have a Moonstone for you. Um, items have been sorted. Oh, you can just do that? That's actually sweet. Um, but yeah, like, you, if you, like, it could sense that you wanted any form of dream that your heart desires, and it just gives it to you. Like, mwah, that, that's why I want it. That's why I want it. I want it to give me every single dream that I want, you know? Because uh, there's definitely some things that aren't PG and that I can't talk about that I would really love to have sometimes. But, you know, 
We'll probably get, like, a stupid Pokemon. I'm, like, waiting for us to get a stupid Pokemon. I'm, like, straight up genuinely waiting for this to be a dumb Pokemon. We'll find out. What? <laughs> well, so much for it being a dumb Pokemon. <laughs> okay, game. This game has been weird, and I'm for it. I am all for this game being weird. Okay, so we know it has Roar of Time. Or that it will learn Roar of Time by the time that we have to level it up. Wow. What do I hit it with, though? Ooh, it's got Aqua Tail. Wow, this thing's got a move set. Okay. Well, I can go into Brittany. Because Brittany can hit it with a not very effective move like Aqua Jet. And do less than half. I could actually probably hit it with two Aqua Jets, which is why I'm gonna actually surf it instead. Actually, no, I don't trust that. I'm not gonna surf it. I'm gonna I'm gonna Aqua Jet it and see what it does. Because if I surf it and it dies, I'm gonna be mad. So we'll see. Oh, it would have lived a surf. But now does it? Wait, we're gonna have to test it. It should live another. It should live a surf though. Yeah. Ooh. Uh-oh. Okay, so it's got Dragon Dance, Dragon Pulse, Aqua Tail, and Roar of Time. So Aqua Tail's actually our biggest thing of worry, which it really isn't because it's Aqua Tail. Okay, we're fine. We're, we're chill. We're chill. We're chill. We're chill. Okay. If Aqua Tail is what we have to be worried about, we should be chill. Oh my god. Come on. Oh, it, it, it missed the first Roar of Time. Good, good, good job, Dredagon. You're, the, you're great. We love you. Um, but yeah, like, the special moves aren't going to hit us very hard, um, and Aqua Tail's going to do not much. Dredagon, please just be... Ugh. Come on, Dredagon. Come on, Dredagon. You're, you're fine, Dredagon. See, Brittany tanks. Brittany will sit here and tank all your hits, just getting the ball, so that Brittany doesn't have to tank more hits. Dredagon. Are we, are we not connecting? Are we not connecting these dots that Brittany is a god... And, like, again, Brittany is a god. We can, we can get in the ball, Dredagon. You are a very good Pokemon who has Dragon Dance plus Aqua Tail that I would really, really love to have on the team because you're very hard hitting um, and can make yourself faster. So, like, um, please, Dredagon. This does not, well, how much does a plus one? Oh, it actually does six. Okay. But come on, Dredagon. You, you be a good boy. Are you going to be a good little boy? Are you going to be a good little boy? You better be a good little boy. A good little boy, Jodagon. We'll have, like, literally an entire team of males, but that's fine. You know, four males, two females. We'll live with it. Oh, you just wanted to know that you had male friends. Oh, my God. Aww. Well, that's good to know. Naming you Troy. <laughs> I don't care. I'm naming it Troy. It's going to be named Troy. Because he just wanted to know that his core was sexy. And it's fine. <laughs> this, episode, this is another one of those what the frick episodes. But I stand them. I stand these form of these fine, kind of fine dining episodes. Okay. We have a Dredagon named Troy on the team. Okay. I mean... <laughs> what? We need a Toxic Orb and Stat. Wow. I think you can actually get one in this game. Troy has Poison Heal. You know what that makes... That... that this makes too much sense. <laughs> Gosh dang it. I love what the, like, the, 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 that was meant to be. He wanted to know that he had friends that were boys. He wanted to know. <laughs> if we get a talk, if this is a toxic orb. No, it's a sky plate. Okay. I was, it's an Arceus plate, but so that's something already in and of itself. But thank goodness. I was going to, I was going to be kind of a little frick, not frick fact. Um, laughing. Oh, it's the Ugo Blip stone. Well, we kind of don't want the Oogle Blip stone. <laughs> don't really want the Oogle Blip. Uh, 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 a critting thing? Okay. 
And a great ball. We'll take that. Well, well this is that's all W's. Um, okay, so now let's talk to our girl Joy, our amazing, amazing girl Joy, and then we tell Joy that she's amazing, and she's still in awe for what she saw. Which I mean, I would be in awe too. I mean, you, you, you. Joy had to, well, Joy had to be there and witness me catch the Pokemon that I conveniently named with Troy. <laughs> Why wouldn't Joy be there when I catch the Pokemon and decide to name Troy? Oh, <laughs> this game. <laughs> I'm loving Unova. Can we just stay in Unova? This is too much fun. Um, I think this is actually time eclipse for this episode, though. It is perfect timing. That sense of the 25-minute mark is right on the dot. We love you all. Well, it's not really on the dot, but it's within the minute. We love you all on this amazing 17-degree night over in the Pacific Northwest. And we'll continue recording because this was a fun one. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye.